Hello folks, we got another one here for you. It's a GT 1965 Mustang Fastback. It's got the obligatory fog lights and through the rear valence dual exhaust. It's got styled steel wheels, correct 1965 style with the trim rings. It's got dual red line tires, front disc brakes. I'm struggling with the light here, so I'll try to keep the sun out of the, out of the shot. Lovely, lovely car. Um, purchased it out of Wisconsin. It has some little bit of Colorado history. I believe Colorado and then also um, looks like Charlotte, North Carolina area. Excellent condition car. <coughs> Pardon me. Minor, minor use marks as you get with a car that's been enjoyed. A little scratch there. A little bit of cracking there. Um, the car was just washed and dried, but it's a little cool out, so it may not have dried fully. You might see some, some areas of moisture. <coughs> Pardon me. Everything so far is in nice shape. The interior is extremely original. It's a very striking combination of the vintage burgundy and then the tan interior, as we'll show you when we get to the interior of the car. <coughs> Pardon me. GT side stripes, Mustang lettering. GT lower badges. As you can see, the shut lines are beautiful on the car. Doors open and close very well. Boot and bonnet do the same. <coughs> Chrome's very nice on the car. Engine bay is very clean. Front edge of the cowl is very nice. <coughs> Inner wings are very nice. Clear VIN number. Showing the A code. Necessary for a GT. There we go. Radiator support is very clean. This is a Metuchen, New Jersey built car, and is as such, it has an extra data plate, which you can see right there, and it shows P10, performance image option tells you it is a GT. Nice clean and tidy engine. Chrome valve covers, chrome air cleaner as you can see. Even the underside of the bonnet's very nice and neat. Sold a GT about three weeks ago and just sold a consigned GT the other day for a friend of ours. Tan interior is very original. You'll see some tape right here by my finger. This edge seems that this edge is very common as falling off, so we just um, glued it with the correct 3M adhesive and taped it. Got the door data plate right there. I cleared it up. We'll get a proper rubber bumper for there. Felts look good. Interior is largely, origi largely original, as far as I can tell. So, um, you know, there are little marks, as you can see, right there. But it's not something that you'd ever change the interior for. Fold down rear seat. Headliner, headliner looks really nice. Sorry, I'm choking a bit. It's got uh, deluxe pony interior, so you got the running horses and the badge. Um, front seat belts, as you can see. Um, it's got the GT glove box uh, door with the little black scalloping along the top, same as the instrument cluster. Um, and it has a rally pack, a tack and a clock. Um, in front of the driver, Ford AM radio. She is a four speed, which of course is very desirable. <clears throat> disc brake pedal because it has disc brakes, fog light switch, pony mats. Just a nice, tidy car. GT. Four speed V8. Don't really know what else there is to desire. The color is spectacular. 
We've sold several vintage burgundy cars. And they sell very, very well. Dare I say, better than red. Just a nice, clean, honest car. Um, it was sold by a big outfit in America in 2016 for quite a large amount of money. We do have the window sticker from them. Personally, I'm quite taken with the car. When I saw it, it took me about a week to purchase it. Um, but I finally got the deal done, and I'm happy I did. P Mustang, that's P Mustang at gmail.com, www.classicamericancarsales.co.uk, or 07742 604 906. Look forward to hearing from you. We have this and many other Mustangs, Fastbacks, a convertible, and coupes in stock. Always more coming. We do some very high quality projects, and we have everything up to first class show cars. Come talk to us.